what is up you guys it is Dumais45 here and in this video I'm gonna be giving you guys a quick look and a hands on of Google's second new keyboard for Android and they are calling it Google handwriting input so hold on guys I'm gonna give you guys a quick look of that okay so first after downloading the app from the Google Play Store which I left a link to in the video description below you guys will see here that this is the layout for the app itself. You'll first need to enable it, then set it as your input method, and then you have to select the keyboard itself, just like so. And if we go into the settings of it, you can change the theme of the keyboard itself. You can change, you can turn on and off the cloud button, which shows which is used for online recognition you can share use its statistics to help make it better and you can share your handwriting samples to help google improve the keyboard itself so basically uh what and obviously you can configure some of your languages here if you don't speak english it has support for other languages as well i just don't know what they are and you can always help improve the keyboard itself by checking this box right here and then once you've done all that you can go ahead and open up any app that uses a keyboard obviously and this is what the keyboard will look like it appeals more to the um the design of android lollipop material design so obviously this app will look like material design and from here you'll be able to just basically draw any letter or any sign you want and it will input that into the keyboard right away so if and even if you have bad handwriting according to google it they say they'll still be able to detect what you're trying to write and still give an accurate response to what you're trying to type so let's see if i type hello and forgive me guys um for my screen right here my um my touch screen right now is kind of messed up but let's say if i write hello as you guys can see no matter how bad my handwriting may be it still recognizes as h then if i write e it still recognizes it as e then l or that l Okay, now it's not getting me. L, then L again, then O. Okay, that's not O, just like that. And yeah, E, L, L. Oh, as you guys see here, it recognizes very well. It recognizes my handwriting very well. And A still does. B, C, D, E, F. F. As you guys see here, it recognizes my handwriting very well. And you can see these other buttons here at the bottom. One is for the input method, which obviously lets you change your keyboard. This other button here is for online recognition. And this other button is for back, one for erase, one for spacebar, and one for enter. And as you guys see here, there's also a uh, predictive text right away. So yeah, you'll... You'll be able to change it just like so. And so far, since I just got this keyboard a few minutes ago, I haven't noticed any problems or bugs on this whatsoever, as including this uh, keyboard on the my phone are real. It seems to, to be recognizing my handwriting very well, despite me having problems with the. Uh... And you can also do signs here just like so. And so far, guys, I haven't noticed any problems. The This keyboard seems to be working pretty well. I, I haven't had any problems with it whatsoever. 
and so far my impressions of the lot of the uh, keyboard seem to be pretty positive so far and overall this seems to be a very good alternative to just the regular keyboard and I do recommend this if you don't like your traditional keyboard on your Android device it's always good to have options like these especially from Google so either way guys that is it that is my quick look and my hands on of Google handwriting input which is a keyboard from Google Google's second keyboard the other one is Google keyboard obviously and yeah that is it guys that is my quick look at my hands-on of Google handwriting input now if you guys like this video feel free to give it a thumbs up because that will definitely help me out and if you have any suggestions on what I should do next or if you have any problems with this app whatsoever feel free to let me know in the comment section below and while you're at it feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel because I got tons of more content coming your way and thank you guys for watching I hope you guys will like me on facebook follow me on twitter follow me on instagram I left all those links in the video description below once again thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video this is Demisa45 signing off.